Okay, so now uh, we're going to draw the walls. And one thing that we want to pay attention to first is our levels. We go to our level, and it's a 10 foot. And we want to uh, level, and we want to connect uh, our first floor to our roof level. Okay, so when I go to walls right here under first floor, I'm going to hit wall, and I'm on my basic wall exterior six and a half okay inch and uh, for height we're doing height and we're going to connect it to the second floor this says 20 feet uh, it will not make it 20 feet because it's just connecting to the second floor and we're going to change the location line to core face exterior remember core face this is important in order to get our walls exactly uh, where we want them according to the sheeting I believe we'll find out what happens later um, in the model we might need to make some changes so we're going to do that and now when we draw our walls we need to do it clockwise so it puts out the outside of the wall on the outside so I'm just going to do my basic wall structure here I'm going to do uh, I'm going to do a nice long on the assignment I said um, no larger than 30 feet by 40 feet I'm going to turn this into my my big man cave garage uh, almost living quarters the more you zoom in here the more accurate we can get so we'll go 30 feet and we'll just come here and do that and then I'm going to hit escape and if I go up here to my 3D view, we have walls. Uh, I realize as I made it connect, those walls connected when I click on these. Uh, I believe it will show over here in properties that they are uh, constrained to upper level 2, so it only made them 10 feet instead of 20 feet, and that's good. Other than I just did something weird there, I'll hit undo. There we go. Now my walls look good, okay?